Inspa, which means breath. Come on. Then piration, which means God. So in other words, you can say God's breath. So in other words, the Bible that we have, all scriptures, is the breath of God. When you die and you stop breathing, your breath is gone away. That's why we don't say we are going to bury this man. We say the body. Why? Because your breath, your life is gone out. So if God breathed this word, it means when you have this word, you've got him himself. Amen. So you are so privileged to have the breath of God. When you have the word of God in you, you've got the breath of God. And nothing can destroy you. Why? Because God, who is the word, lives in you. That's why we need more of the word of God. That's why when people begin to tell stories in the pulpit, I get amazed. I've got a friend, he phones me every evening, and he reading scriptures, and he tells me. And every question, the question that has been asked is, uh, why don't we read the scriptures in the church? I said, I don't know. We have to get back to the scriptures. It's the breath of God. Yeah. God breathed his word. That's why the Bible in Psalms says uh, he has exalted his word. He has put his word above his name. So God will not go against his word. That's his will. He will not rewrite it. He has given it to you. If he says, I'll heal you, God is going to heal you. Stand on the word. Go back to him to say, you have said this is your breath. Do you know why the police tell somebody when they're arresting you? Don't say anything. Whatever you say will work against you in the courts of law. Why? Power of words. Mama Mkanda will preach the message on the power of what we say. Say the word. Why? It's the breath of God. The Bible is the breath of God. It's like God himself breathing. God himself speaking into your life. That's why we are so excited. That's why we, we stand on the word of God to say, God, this book, no matter the opinion of man, I'm not going by what they say. People come, people go. But this word has been forever. Amen. Who shall I believe? The opinion of a, of a politician, a, a opinion of a professor in university. Professors have come, professors have gone. The word stands. It's the breath of God Amen. given by God. So how did scripture come about? God gave it. He breathed come on. upon his people and they began to write. 